XYZ stand. Now, if you like going on holiday and having an all-inclusive, well, you need to be talking to Martin about the XYZ UMC 5X machine because it's basically like having all of the extras in one, isn't it, Martin? It is indeed, yeah. <laughs> now, what you've got with this as standard, and it takes a lot of the thought process out of buying a 5 axis machine, you've got linear scales as standard, you've got through spindle coolant as standard, you've got a 35 kilowatt motor offering 15,000 RPM as standard, rotary scales as standard, you've got through table um, hydraulics and pneumatics as standard, <laughs> C-axis motor on the, uh, the direct drive on the motor on the C-axis as standard, <laughs> and the list goes on, there's an awful lot of extras. You need to have one of those things where we can see how many times you say as standard on this machine. Now let's talk about this um, table. What can the table take? What's its capacity? Okay, due to, as you can see, it's a very open structure and you've got equal size bearings on both sides of the trunnion. That gives rise to a 600 kilo capacity. So a 600 diameter performance, but also 600 kilos in terms of weight capacity, which is well in excess of most of the other machines out there in the marketplace. You've also got, for the C-axis, you've got a direct drive, you've got torque motor direct drive which gives rise to higher rotational speeds and, and better performance in the long run as well. And is this bridge type construction, what are the benefits of it? Okay, there's, yeah, the, the bridge type gantry construction offers a number of benefits, predominantly to do with rigidity and performance of the machine. Mm. Other machines out there tend to have your uh, Y axis on a ram that's protruding from the machine. Mm. Um, that can give rise to variations in terms of performance depending on where you are in the Y axis. With this machine, with the gantry, you've always got a fixed distance between your spindle centre line and your bearing support, which therefore gives rise to consistent machining across the whole, the whole gamut of the, of the machining area. And the tooling? Tooling, number of options, sorry, not just a standard, but um, we've got 30 tools, 24, 30, 48, 60 tools um, as your options. We've also got whether we have an open, open or enclosed roof, um, that's, that's an option as well. And what's so, the benefits there? Well, look, if we, we can offer this, again, as standard with 20 bar through spindle coolant, um, we can offer 70 bar high pressure coolant, the machine's already prepped for that as well so it's not a major inconvenience to go up to that level. Obviously if you're running 70 bar the chances are you're going to want that roof to be closed over to prevent all the spray of, of coolant or swarf coming out of the machine. And who are you aiming this machine to and, and for the accuracy as well? Yeah look it is an incredibly accurate machine, as I mentioned earlier linear scales are standard. You've got <laughs> Linear, linear repeatability of 2.5 microns in all axis. Um, you've got five seconds plus or minus on the rotary axis as well. So very, very accurate machine. So look, people that are multi-loading at the moment, if they're doing a lot of operations on three axis machines and they're just looking to eliminate a lot of the, the second opping and third opping, if they can put the part on here. But ideally, with the 15,000 RPM, a lot of mold makers, a lot of people that do require fantastic surface finish, you're going to get that with this machine as well. Yeah, and the software, you've got Siemens and Heidenheim? Yeah, now we run two, two options there. We've got either the Siemens 840D control. As standard? As standard. <laughs> <laughs> but also we run the Heidenheim 640 as well as an option. Um, just one thing to also mention, um, we can also offer this as a, U, as a UMC 4 plus 1 as opposed to a 5-axis ah. as well. So for those people that don't necessarily need true 5-axis simultaneous, but they want still 5-sided machining, uh, it's exactly the same machine, but it's, it's simply 4 plus 1, and it utilises a Siemens 828 control as opposed to a Siemens 840. Uh, but it just brings the price down to be an incredibly competitive price machine. You know what? You should do my job, because that was the next question I was going to ask. <laughs> <laughs> Look, price point... Yeah, you, you'll not find anything as competitively priced with all those inclusions as standard. I know I used to work for other machines or companies offering a very similar capacity machine, but would be twice, three times the price of what I'm standing in front of here. There you, have, there you have it. Martin Barber on the XYZ UMC 5X machine as standard. <laughs> Thank you.